Ninth race is the 2001 Trotting Classic Open Mile. Here they come. There, Rafan trotting, and Hank Angus is looking for a big start from the far outside. Rama's Pleasure, Good Times, and Plesak leaving hard. Tucking behind the speed will be Magician to be out well into the top five. Wild Turkey follows through in a tight spot from sixth. Then it's back to Goldfish and Fool's Gold, the extreme outside, and Trevor Ritchie will send Rama's Pleasure on up to take over the lead. On the inside, second is Plesak, Magician floated up on the outside. Now Dave Miller drives him at the lead. The quarter was 27 and four. There goes Magician against Rama's Pleasure into the backside and Magician parked around the first turn and first three eighths, but is up to take over the lead and take command. Rama's Pleasure yielded without a tussle, sits along in second, Plesak is third, Hank Angus parked out in fourth and Good Times got a seat in from fifth. Fool's goal overland all the way from sixth position, then it's back to Wild Turkey and Goldfish is trailing by two more lengths, but brought to the outside. Magician makes the half in fifth. 57 and 3. A much more moderate second quarter of 29 and 4. Magician the leader into the final 3 eighths. Rama's Pleasure trots pocket position after surrendering the lead to the heavily favored Magician. And on the inside third, Plesak is under a huge hold to O'Donnell. There goes Fool's goal. Three wide around the parked out and winded Hanko Angus. Good times. Trapped along the inside. Third from last, Wild Turkey is going three deep. And trailing on the final turn was Goldfish. Fool's goal is off stride. And and it's up to Magician now. His to win or lose. And Miller hasn't raised the whip yet. And he slingshotted off the turn to a five-length lead on Rama's Pleasure. Plesak is off stride. Wild Turkey, the extreme outside. And uh, Goldfish is closing well. But look at the show Magician is putting on. World-class talent coming to the wire alone at Mohawk Racetrack. Here is the finish for Magician to defeat Rama's Pleasure. And Goldfish was third. An unurged 155 in the trotting classic mile for Magician. Took the final division of the classic series tonight to produce a winning favorite and it took the world class Magician to do it. Um, Dave Miller looked pretty much like a walk in the park for him. Yeah, it went real good. Uh, he got, got to the front and got a real easy uh, middle half there for him and uh, came home real good. Off the gate, uh, you got away in a mid-pack or so. Uh, it looked like you had absolutely no intentions of going to the rail. Was the game plan just to let things settle and go from there? Uh, when they got, you know, everybody got over and got to the rail, they started uh, going pretty, you know, grabbing up there. And uh, he was getting there easy enough. And uh, the plan was uh, just to keep him in the clear and uh, try to give him the easiest trip as I could. Last year, uh, he made more than a million dollars in a fantastic year uh, facing the likes of Moneymaker. Uh, with uh, a horse like her out of the picture this year, uh, do you think he can be a real dominant force for the entire year? Uh, yeah, so far he has been. Uh, you know, if, things, if he stays healthy and stays good, uh, I think he's got a real good shot. Is he uh, better than he was last year at this point or as good? He, he seems to be uh, maybe just a little better uh, as far as his manners goes. He's, he's uh, gotten real good. Uh, as far as his strongness goes, uh, he really hasn't uh, had, you know, showed any weaknesses yet. So uh, I think he's pretty good shape. Okay, Dave, congratulations. Thank you. Dave Miller and Magician, they finally pull through one for the favorites tonight in the final division of the Classic. Let's take a look at the prices.